Okay, so picture this. You've got a trip to Ireland coming up. Lucky you. The luck of the Irish. Exactly. But you're also someone who likes to squeeze every last drop out of an adventure, right? And you're wondering. Hmm. Is this love to visit Ireland? Premium subscription? Like the golden ticket to even more Irelandy goodness. You got it. So let's dive deep into this, shall we? See if this upgrade is worth the, well, the upgrade. What's really interesting to me here right off the bat is how they frame it, this whole upgrade thing. It's less about what you get and more like how they make you feel. Oh, how so? Well, they hit you with this less than a pint at Temple Bar Line. And anyone who's ever had a pint in Dublin, let me tell you, you're not getting out of there on the cheap. So true. They're basically saying, look, skip one round at the pub, get this instead. Clever. Right. But is it actually a good deal? That's for us to find out because in-depth regional features and hidden gems, those are kind of vague. Yeah, good point. Because a hidden gem for one person could be a total dud for someone else, you know? A hundred percent. It all comes down to you, the traveler. Yeah. Are you like the kind of person who loves going off the beaten path? Or are you more about hitting those big famous landmarks. This reminds me actually this one time in Galway, I got SO turned around and stumbled on this tiny pub like tucked away down an alley. Oh, I love those kinds of discoveries. Right. Best live music ever. Those are the moments you remember, not the, you know, the gift shop at the castle or whatever. Totally. And that's exactly the feeling they're trying to tap into here, right? That desire for the authentic, less touristy side of things. Speaking of authentic, they do mention a deep dive on County Dublin and this whole premium thing, connecting it to, get this, Molly Malone. Oh, okay. Now that's a name I haven't heard in a while. Right. I'm already kind of sold on that alone, to be honest. But then there's this whole other thing. They highlight their free daily newsletter too. Call it a gift for their loyal followers. It's like a little pat on the head almost. Like we appreciate you freebie folks, B-U-T. Yeah, exactly. If you really loved Ireland, you'd be on the premium train settle but i see what they're doing oh for sure but okay let's forget the marketing for a second talk content yeah they mentioned a county carry feature coming out in their sunday email is county carry on your list of must sees hmm that's a good point and they make a big deal about that sunday email don't they like it's some kind of can't miss event it's fomo classic fomo fear of missing out is anyone really planning their whole trip around a newsletter though probably not but hey it's a tried and true marketing tactic true enough the thing is don't let yourself feel pressured. Look at what you want to get out of this trip, you know? Information overload isn't always a good thing. Okay, so we've gone deep. We've looked at all the angles. Yeah. To upgrade or not to upgrade, that is the million-dollar question. Here's the thing. If you're the type who loves to really dig into the details, who gets excited about finding those under-the-radar spots, and, hey, who maybe enjoys some beautiful photography to get them in the mood. Because who doesn't love some good travel porn? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Then, you know, this premium subscription, it might be right up your alley. It's about knowing yourself and how you travel best. Couldn't have said it better myself. And hey, even if you decide to stick with the free version, there's a whole lot of Ireland out there just waiting to be explored. Absolutely. That's what it's all about. That's it for this deep dive, folks. We'll be back soon with more travel tips and tricks. And remember, adventure awaits.